Okay, so there's a, a video that I'm going to be putting together here in a minute. But I wanted to show you some of the stuff that I got in a garage sale today. Well, first of all, my maintenance guy at work got these big brass pieces for me, which is good. Um, these I paid 50 cents for. They're brass. Not sure I got a good deal on that. This thing is heavy. This lamp. And you look at the lamp and go, well, it's got a big weight at the bottom. Huh. No. It's freaking solid. This will this way this thing. Look at that. Almost nine pounds. Okay, so this didn't have a price tag on it, so I asked the lady, I said it didn't have a price tag on it. She said two bucks. Or no. I got this for three bucks. This is the one that didn't have a price tag on it. She said this is two bucks. Pretty sure that's brass too. It's got some junk on it, but it's not magnetic. Obviously, this is brass. But anyway, I want to take this thing apart if I can, if it comes apart, or it might just be one big piece. I don't know. But anyway, three bucks for that. Great deal. This came off of a unit. I'm just going to have that for the cord. This whole bag of cords was all free, it was in someone's free box. So I'll go through that. Clip the ends and throw it in my wire bin. These are dumpster dive finds from yesterday. Of course, a big piece of brass on the on the faucet, so that's good. And this was a giveaway for free. And I also have a couple more uh, pieces of metal in my truck that I got for free as well. Uh, just scrap metal. A lot of stuff I got for free, which is always good. And I'm going to make out like a bandit on this sucker, I think. These are all the cords that I got for free today. That's what I like about um, garage sales, is a lot of these places have a box out towards the front that says free, and they're happy if you take as much as you can. And someone just had a bunch of cords, and I'm happy to... I'm happy to take the cords. This kind of stuff is all stuff that nobody else wants, typically, and a household has all kinds of it. I'll just cut the ends. Ends like this that have metal on them, I'll put that in shred. Oh, it's Friday. Fridays are so nice. You know, working for a living uh, is not all it's cracked up to be. <laughs> I, uh, Look forward to retirement because I know I'm going to be able to stay plenty busy. Let's see what we got. Another one of these. I'm going to keep that just for the the brass ends on it. And I got this thing. I don't know what it is. It almost looks like a. Uh, I don't even know. Oh wait, here's a little instruction booklet. A voltage converter kit. Oh, I bet. Uh, like if you travel overseas, these are all the different types of um, thingies, plugs that those countries use. I'm gonna put that with my plugs because I'm gonna take that apart. I'm not gonna be traveling overseas. I can't think of one country that I feel safe traveling to. Barely feel safe in this one. Yeah. All else fails, pull it apart. Another plug for my plug soup. All right. More wire. Let's trim some more wire. Soup. Plug soup. You gotta love uh, free wire. I mean, now this bag also has some coax in it. Now, I didn't want the coax, but I didn't want to sit there and pick through it too much either. I just grabbed the bag and got the heck out of there before they changed their mind. Just throw the coax away. My yard won't even take it. 
We'll take it for shred or anything. Wow, these are some long. This is a long one. That's what she said. Yeah, we'll just cut these ends off. It's good wire. Another one. Jeez Louise, that is shred. Coax, what a waste. Think about how much of this crap is in the United States. How much we come across and we just leave it. And the rest of that is coax. Put all this in the shred. I don't know man, days like this, Will make your stash go up pretty quick. I'm not talking your mustache. Okay. That'd be nice to get a 55 gallon drum of wire. Three bucks I got this lamp for. Boy, that looks funky on the inside. I don't know if you see the it's just got a weird color in there. Oh, here we go. We're unscrewing down here. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh, there's a knot right there. There we go. That's magnetic. Oh, Lordy, that's magnetic too. It might be, other than the centerpiece, the only magnetic part. Yeah, that is not, that is not. Wow, look at that. I gotta get under a light here so you guys can see that. That's funky in there. It's gotta be brass though. screws in there yeah 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 that's got to be magnetic yeah so wait a minute oh no oh jeez <laughs> Uh, I think I got bamboozled. This is silvery, so it looks like this is cast aluminum. Oh Lord! Ah, oh, oh, they want to swear so bad right now. Okay, so this is brass. Oh no. It's freaking gold plated something or another. It's not brass. Well, I just got kicked right in the kibbles and bits right there. This thing's brass. I know this one is. Oh, so I paid three bucks for this and I'm gonna lose my butt on it. In relative terms, anyway. Cut this old cord off of here. Scrapping's fun. Like a box of chocolates, I guess, right? This is a little screw is brass, I'm sure. I'll get that off of there now that I'm desperate to pay off my investment. I got hosed. Well, she didn't say it was brass. It wasn't it wasn't labeled as brass. Clearly. Now if that's not brass, I'm jumping off a bridge. Well <clears throat> I'm 
puts this on the wheel real quick, see what it does. I think this is cast as well. Okay, we're gonna stop messing around here and put my grinder to work. Yep, definitely not brass. It is cast freaking aluminum. As are these. Good lord. I just took a high heel right to the beans. Now, on a positive note, this is seven pounds or whatever of good cast aluminum. And this, please be brass, please. Oh. Okay, it's not the end of the world. This is this is cast as well. Um, I mean that's scrap, but really you don't really know. I've got a buddy uh, that I buy my graphite molds from that gets a lot of jewelry from garage sales. He'll if it's not magnetic, he'll buy it no matter what. He only has to hit on one out of twenty items for it to pay for it, and then a whole lot more. He doesn't care if it's not. So this is fine. This is going to be all right. I got some good stuff. Got a bunch of wire for free. I got this sink thing for free. And a little bit of brass here, which isn't going to amount to squat, but that's all right. I am not sad. Well, I'm, I was sad, but I'm over it already. It is what it is. We're gonna take this, we're gonna cut it. Put this with all my plugs. I'm gonna cut this. So there we go. Bummer, bummer, but. Yeah.